שלום וברכה, מי השם give you happiness, ברכה והצלחה, בריאות. I would like to tell you something about my father, עליו השלום. We are now the month of Elul, the month of Emunah, the month that we prepare ourselves for, uh, for ימים נוראים, and we, have, we need lawyers. When, when you have a problem with a justice, so you need a good lawyer, and the good lawyers are tzaddikim. Who knows who's going to live, who's going to be poor, who's going to die, who's going to be ill, who's going to be healthy, who's going to have children, who's going to get married, who's going to divorce, you know, everything. The wars, all what's happened this year, it was, unfortunately, on Rosh Hashanah, it was written, written that, that what that would happen. But Baruch Hashem, we saw miracles. Baruch Hashem, we saw miracles, miracles, especially this week, miracles, miracles. So Baruch Hashem, my father, Allah Shalom, before his father passed away, he told him, I don't want you to leave the house. Stay in the house where you were born. At that time, my father was not married. And he, he asked my he asked his father, Rabbi Chaim Pinto, from, what about my marriage? He said, your mazal, she will come to you in this house. Don't worry, just stay here. Pray. You have a synagogue. You have everything. Hashem will protect you. Don't go out. Remain in this house. You know your wife? Her name is Mazal. Her mother, she lost her, she used to lose the children, and I give her the bracha that her daughter, she will live, and she will give you her daughter. So she will come to this house. And that's what happened. My father, Allah Hashem, was a big tzaddik. He was not a material man. He was very, at the beginning, he was very poor. Very, very poor. Very poor. Because people used to give him some money, but the house has a lot of expenses, so he used to spend money to keep the house, you know. And the Baruch Hashem has seems, Hashem sent him my mother, her name is Mazal, and uh, they got married. And a lot of times I ask my grandmother, Mami, is Rabbi Chaim Pinto? Who, who pray for you that my mother she will not die? He said yes, and she told me it's Rabbi Chaim Pito who give her the name Mazal. So, so this is a, this is the story of my father and my father and my mother. She was a rich woman. Unfortunately, they lost everything, but she did never complain that there is no money because she knew that her husband is a tzaddik. My friend, sometimes he did not have another spare shirt to change. So he should clean his shirt and to dry it on his body. Yes, yes, madam, yes, sir. And then one day he had to take his few. They were falling and there was a dentist who told him I can take out all what you have left and I put you you know uh, something you know instead of your thief at the beginning my father asked, he accepted and then my father didn't want to put this in his, in his mouth he said well Hashem he gave me my thief he took them I don't want to put out on me, to put on me something that is not real. So he did not accept. So he used to swallow food. He didn't eat. He didn't enjoy food. And that's why he was always so close to Hashem. And then one day, he asked, he asked, Hashem, Hashem, now I've been here for 15 years in this house. And now I want to go to Casablanca and from there I want to go to Israel give me a sign that I have to leave 
as soon he finished the course, the glass of Rabbi Chaim Pinto that he was on the room where he studied, he failed and he was broken. So my father was a sign that he can leave now the city and go back to Casablanca. And from Casablanca he did the Aliyah. But listen, so much he was holy that he wanted to print a book, had no money. And he told my, my mother, Madeleine, go and buy me a lottery and you will win exactly the amount that the, the book will cost. That's what happened. So I told my father years later, why, uh, my Papa, if you, have, if you are so close to Hashem, why you didn't, uh, why didn't uh, win uh, more money in the lottery? He said, what Hashem wants to give me, He will give me. I don't need more than what, what I need. May His Zichut be with you. Amen, amen, amen. Shana Tova.